good. Look at the uh, look at the jellyfish. Oh, I love the jellyfish. I've got to see the jellyfish at night. Yeah, we've got them back on the right here. A great frog. <laughs> great frog. One of our great God, jewelry shops. Like this shop. Come on, it's dark. Come. It's dark and it's twisted. I like the, is that a cheetah or a leopard? Or a, what is that? Which With the big tooth. Oh, the saber tooth tiger. Saber tooth tiger. <gasps> oh, yeah, he's great, isn't he? I like the ring. The oh, that's eagle. it. Eagle. The eyeballs. Oh, look, look, a little cannabis leaf. And a little skull. That's so cool. I like that skull zombie. Bracelet skull. Oh. oh my god, and that's a bracelet. And that's a bracelet. That's so cool. Oh. Maddie likes that saber toothed tiger. Is there anything in here you'd like for Christmas? Look at that. That's a ball of fish. Oh wow, look at that. Oh, it's beautiful. Can you get close enough to see how cool that is? Oh, look at these boxer shorts. <laughs> look at those. Oh, they're perfect for you. Oh, elf oh, shorts. God. <laughs> oh, you're an angry elf. I'm an angry elf. Any other men out there that knows Carnaby Street, there's always been a Ben Sherman on Carnaby Street. In fact, I think the first Ben Sherman shop was on Carnaby Street, and it used to be a big thing, getting a Ben Sherman shirt. Oh, I don't think oh, I've ever had cool. one. Going into true religion. I'm a bit of a completionist, aren't I, like you? I like to think that if we're going to do a street, you know, no, I mean, I'm unlike you. Yeah. I like to... <laughs> the complete opposite. Yeah, I'm not like you. Yeah. I like to do a street literally from the end to the other end. That's why we had to find a much shorter street than Oxford Street. Yeah, Oxford Street was too long. Because of our terrible journey yeah. in. G-Shock. Do you remember G-Shock? Anyway, so we're getting to the end of Carnaby Street where there's Sweaty Betty and a really odd funky shop on the right. I like the Liars you like? and Lovers. That's a good shop, girls. Liars and there. Lovers. Go and have a look in there. Oh, look at this in the window. Ah. This is the place that you find something for Nanny Dye oh, and for Teddy. And for Lisa. Let's go in. Beg your pardon? Amy again. Oh, Amy's here. I've got an Amy's shoe thing. Amy again. Amy again. What's this? Oh, look at that. Future with no fear, past, with no regrets, present. She does. She certainly used to. Hang on, I, want, I want to show you something there that I don't want Nanny to die to see, so you can't put this in the vlog. Sorry. <laughs> the end of Carnaby Street because the girls have sorted out lots of Christmas presents. <laughs> well, one, all right, one, one Christmas present. Do you know what you have to remember? It's so nice just take a moment and talk to people in a shop. So I said, oh, thank you. We love your shop. Oh, do you? Oh, we're so excited. So listen to this. This shop is called the Souvenir Revolution, yeah. right? Because her fat, the, the founder of the shop, was going home one day on the bus and she saw one after another these really tacky souvenir shops that were just meaningless stuff all made abroad and stuff. Oh, yeah. So everything in here is designed by a London design. So it's a true London uh, souvenir. So all like new artists but they, and creatives. They invert it into kind of irreverent stuff, don't they? Yeah. Like attacking the Queen. And it's just <laughs> one third best shop in London for Time Out. Wow. And we were going to miss it, and then we just saw That's it at the last minute. That's me saying we should come no, well, I, the No, I had seen it as well. Yeah, all oh, right, so. it's all you then, is it? I did, it's I did. It's all about you. Yeah. <laughs> that just takes a whole new meaning on it, doesn't it? And what a cool place to be, you, Amy. And what a cool place for you to get Nanny Di's Christmas presents. Yeah. She'll love that story, Nanny Di. Yeah, yeah make sure you don't put it in, because she'll see it. Well, so, we won't show what you bought, but it's really nice. Well, I suppose nice. you suggested we come down in it. 
future with no fear past with no regret, a present full of love. Shut up! Which way are we going that Yeah, where are we? Oh, this is pretty. I've never seen this. It's like a Monday. I am this place. It's like Monday. It's just like Camden. Oh, cool. It's a nice place to come and eat. Gosh. Yeah. Did you like Carnaby Street first? Yeah. Well, the pub on this corner, girls, I got barred from when I was 17. <laughs> Did you? For punching a man in the face because he was being rude to my girlfriend. Oh. And I punched him so hard on the nose. So his No, but the part of it that's interesting is I punched him so hard on the nose, he was more shocked by how his head bounced off the window behind him. Oh. And then the what barman leapt over the bar, grabbed me, threw me out, and said, you're barred. You Classic. Shakes, oh. Shakespeare's head. Game, that guy there just sits there all day long writing poetry so you go up and you pay him and he'll write a poem for someone you love. I think you could do that. She could actually. This here guys is Liberties. Liberties is so By famous. Royal Appointment. Yeah. It's a beautiful really, building. Let's go down this thing because it's always the most beautiful flower wow, shop. There's a florist. Gorgeous florist and I, I always want flowers from it because it's like you know there's really I think everyone in London flowers. wants flowers from it but thinks I've then got to travel out of London yeah. carrying flowers. Yeah. Yeah. That's the only problem with the Liberty's flowers. Well, and the price. And the price. So, subs, I'm really hoping for a proper Zoella moment in here. I'm hoping to find some beautiful things that are just beyond Christmasy, 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 Christmasy! Hey! Go on, then. That's not very Christmassy! Oh, look at that. Look at those, oh. see those, those flying flowers. Oh, yes. Those roses there. It's very beautiful. Look at those roses. Maddie, I always think of that as an Amy Winehouse rose. Yeah, I know. Don't you mean. think? It's yeah. her dark. Beautifully colour. dark. And off the ring. Shops, very Zarella. Come on. The girls, you've got to guess how much that is. 200. 200? And the hundreds. hundreds. And how many? 200, Maddie, guess. 150. Mark? 350. 550. Can't buy anything here. <laughs> Here you go. Upstairs, 4-4. Wow, look at this. A little bit like going in Nan's loft. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Floor four. Oh, 
I'm sweating like a pig. is like an Aladdin's cave of uh, Christmas tree decoration. It's phenomenal. It's like colour coordinated. Whose is that one? Who's no, getting? It is. Whoa! Oh. <gasps> You're gonna have to pay for that. You're gonna have to pay for that. Fourteen pounds. You don't know. Can anyone see me anywhere? Oh. They'll see you on the camera. very heavy and the top thing fell out so I'm going to go and talk to you. My glasses on. Fifty-five. Look, no, don't break it. And it's only that. You're going to break that. When I was little and we used to come to shops like this, my mum used to make me sit in the corner yeah, and I wasn't well, allowed to look around. Yeah, we're going to have to do it again. <laughs> I just got vertigo looking over the edge. Terrible vertigo looking over the edge. Mm -hmm. Don't look over the edge. You should have seen it up there. I said I spoke to them and I said I dropped a um, decoration, but I said it was very heavy and it fell out. And she said that's okay. I said I've left it over by the white. She was very nice. 
She was a very friendly man. I'm going to show you what made... Look, you've got to sort my eyebrows out tonight, Betty. I nearly got you those. Oh, it's really annoying because this is really Zoella and now we've got to rush out because we spent too long doing other things and now we're in a Zoella situation. We've got the, a bloody leave. The girls want to go home. I know. A woman just started talking to me, telling me she's got knickers like that. Well, you are a hit with the girls, babe. I know, but I don't want to be a hit with women who wear pink knickers like that. She's oh, very knickers. nice. She was winking at you and everything. What? She winked at you. Look, it's a really flattering shot, look. Yeah, you got up early to do something and ended up walking around. Yeah. Because my body was so messed up. Uh, no, I did it. I did Joe Wicks this morning. I think my panda looks really nice over there. Oh. What? What are you doing? I've just done something so awful. Oh, my God. I don't know how I was going to save myself for dinner. This fucking cake is so good. You've eaten loads. I, look! Look! Just have a bit. We should, it, it is so good. This is the 30 pound one, right? Oh, I'm so annoying because it's so good. I've eaten all of it. Have a bit. No? No. All right. Okay. <laughs> You're my jam. But there's a parcel. Oh my God, is there a parcel? And I saw we're just clearing up next door and I went, what's this? Here, I'll start opening it. He goes, I said, what's this? Oh, Kiki, did you order something? And then there was another identical box. I said, oh, Maddie, did you order something? Anyway, we've just looked. It's only Florence by Mills. <gasps> and it was sent in September. Oh no, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to text Mill Millie because I'll I tell you what, she's gonna send bad I vibes have no by her nose. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's oh, crazy. We just went to Boots the other oh day and god. bought a whole load of stuff of it. Of stuff as well. Oh my lord. We didn't have any left. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh, one, two. Oh, oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Oh, oh, I can't really be. Oh, hey, man. hope you enjoy these little gifts. XOXMOX. Oh, oh, I feel so bad that we haven't seen it. We'll say to her on camera. Oh my Thanks god, so thank you so much. Really? It's so pretty. Yeah. I know, oh my god. I just it's love perfect. the colour of it. Me too. Self expression is everything. Clean ingredients mm. are essential, and beauty is. That's for you to decide. Love Mills. Oh, oh we so love you, honey bunny. So sorry. It's been behind the door since September. Classic us. Classic, classic us. I'm sorry, this, this is very, somebody must this have is very usual for us. Somebody yeah. thought it must have been something else and just put it in there. I didn't remember I had, I had to contact Millie and tell her that I put their converse under my desk and they were there for months. Millie, we're so sorry. It's not them, it's us. We're bloody <laughs> rubbish. We've it's posed. you. <sighs> Should have kept this now for Christmas. I know. Oh, oh, it's so nice. It's all the things bad. you really wanted, don't worry, I'll tell her that. Yeah, you contact them. Yes, yeah, sorry. Just do it now. Do it now. Otherwise, she'll be getting a nosebleed about it. <laughs> Such a beautiful box. Beautiful box. Oh. Are you going to put it on your, um, on your dressing table? Just looks so gonna sit all on your, your dressing table, it just looks so beautiful. What? Oh my God, what a vision of Christmas. What? Now the girls don't usually don't have their phones then. at the table, so <laughs> this is very unusual. You... No, I'm just saying it's unusual. You don't usually. Uh, Your mum's looking very Helen Mirren. Very Helen Mirren. Oh, that's very weird because people say that I look like Helen. Very Helen. Mirren. You do. You do sometimes look like Helen Mirren. No, I don't want to. Look Teddy like sometimes. Nice to see Betty. Teddy, you never look like Helen Mirren. About like four, <laughs> there was somebody in. That uh, was Judy Christie, no, not no, Helen Mirren. Hannah, 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 Hannah. Hannah Montana. Oh no, he said Julie. Oh my God, I can't tell you. Look through the lens, how Christmassy it looks, Mark. I'm looking through the lens, it looks so Christmassy. <laughs> <laughs> it's so nice to, so say hello to the subs guys because they haven't seen you for weeks. Say hello sub. Hello all. <laughs> hello. <laughs> hello. Hello Hola. subs. Hola. Hola, he's been Hola. in Spain. Hola. 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 What was the best meal you had when you were in Marbella? Oh. Uh, Up in the we hills? We enjoyed the sun and the drinks. Oh. More than the meal. Mm, sangria. So were you missing Christmas preparations when you were there? <laughs> no. no, she was not. No. Have you done Christmas shopping yet? No. When are you putting your tree up? 
I'm not. not having a treat. No, Betty. She never puts it up. I put it up for her. Yeah, Where's you do. I She's buy a one and I put it up for her. I haven't got space for it now. I've got all my housework lunch done. No. And they're going to have hmm? lights on them oh, yeah. and no treats. What, what about all those lovely gin today? bottles I bought you last year? Oh, gosh, yes. Where am I? Well, I could put those in the Little plants. sparkly gin bottles. Plants would love a nice bottle of gin. Yeah. Oh, someone's here, I think. Dinner is here. Oh, sorry, guys. I haven't got dinner. I paid for the meal. So... It's some time after when we saw you earlier in our lovely Christmassy um, uh, kitchen, all having a nice glass of champagne, waiting for the food to come to celebrate our birthday that mum had bought and ordered at five o'clock today. Turns so the poor restaurant rings us and say, I'm really sorry, but the driver rang on the door, classic just eat, and uh, nobody was there. Nobody answered. So instead of ringing us, the Just Eat driver took it back to the restaurant and threw it on the table at the guys in the restaurant and said, nobody's there. Didn't call us, didn't anything. We could have gone out of the door. So raging. My mum's got really upset. I can see my dad's upset with my mum. <laughs> and um, so I just went into the restaurant and he said, oh, I've managed to get um, Just Eat to refund your mum. He says, but now the food hasn't been paid for. So I said, so do you want me to pay for the food? And he said, yes, I went, but we've got cold food that's an hour late that we've had to come out and get. Anyway, in the end, he said, okay, you can take it. But I feel really bad for him because I tried, then I tried to pay him. I said, well, let me pay you half because then at least, I said, because I feel bad. I mean, it's stone cold food. I said, but then I'll feel bad that you, that you didn't, you know, you didn't get any money for it. And then in the end, he was so sweet. He went, no, no, it's okay. You know, don't pay feel really bad but I was insisting on paying but he wouldn't let me but we'll use them again but I said to him your problem is we don't want to order from Just Eat we want to order from the restaurant and listen to this restaurant just have a phone that picks up because if you try and order on the phone with the restaurant nobody ever picks up the bloody phone do they <sighs> you're like our local Mary Porters of takeaways God. anyway it's now 10 to 8 kids are starving they were gnawing on the table at half past five and i told them not to have a snack i have to confess i'm slightly hungry too oh god i'm not i just feel well, stressed eating all the bloody christmas i feel cake. worried for mum because mum got really upset she'll be delighted she's ever had a dina complete said, reimbursement dina said she was worrying all day about whether she was going to be able to pull it off the food coming and everything you know because she was worried about whether it would arrive and anyway First world problems, eh? But I do feel sorry for the restaurant. But don't feel sorry for Just Eat and that awful driver. How can you be so rude to the restaurant? Rude to us. Mind you, I suppose he's bloody stressed. His job's probably a bloody nightmare. Just check out Ken Loach's film, Sorry We Missed You, and you'll begin to feel yeah. very, very sorry for parcel delivery. And I do feel sorry. Actually, when I think about it, I just feel sorry for every fucker. Yeah, every fucker's running around like mad in a yeah. hamster wheel trying to make ends meet. My only madness was just because my mum looked worried and upset. That's why I got upset. But otherwise, so what? It's a first world problem, isn't it? Anywho, we'll try and go and create some more of mag magic now. Let's sprinkle some fairy dust. Let's sprinkle some fairy dust.
Love from Betty and Teddy. That's a nice card. Yep. Love from Betty and Teddy. <laughs> <laughs> what else? It's the a same tradition. thing for it's this. A I know. I'd, I'd be upset if there was anything extra. It's a love from Betty. Oh! This looks a bit snuggly. Is it snuggly blankets? Yeah. Oh, gorgeous. And when we're watching the telly. Christmas blanket! <laughs> oh, I love it, Mum. Aren't they gorgeous? Oh my God, that's gorgeous. Got matching. Me and Mark have got matching. Is this in case we ever just sit on the sofa and snap all of it Christmas way? <laughs> I thought they were double-sided. They are, but one's white. One's white. They're that's gorgeous, nice. aren't they? Thank you, Betty. I let Mark have the grey one because he's a boy. They're almost grey. <laughs> are they? Yeah, they're, they're not the same. I'll let, let Mark open his. Oh, oh, they're different colours. <laughs> I think mine's more white. Beautiful. Oh, thanks, Betty. I thought they were double sided. I thought Thank you, Betty. Is already fantastic. What does it say, Maddie? Oh. Don't get excited. I can't see it. Love Hush. No, you do. Oh my god. Mum, it's going in the chicken. Oh. <laughs> I love hush and I love when you get tissue paper. No. Oh, they're lovely! Are they Jamamas? Yeah. Oh god, I'm so desperate for Jamamas. Addy, don't even think about it. Oh. <laughs> she does this all the time. Whenever she nick, you nick my pajamas, and then I actually saw Abby wearing my satin pajamas the other day. Her friend went out to a party in my pajamas. So <laughs> she's doing a quizzical face. What, what trousers? Oh my god, I love them. What's in the box? That's the bag they're going. Everything has to come in a bag these days. That's just stupid. Stupid. Well, make sure they're okay before you do it. Oh, yeah, they're definitely in case we need to. My other favourite place, the White Company. I'll have that box as well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's decoupage. Oh. Oh, my God, I love these. I saw these the other day. I was looking for something oh, for yeah. Stacey's birthday. Oh, I love these. Imagine, feel these. These are going to be the one you're really tempted to steal. Oh, they're nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're really nice. Oh, they're both gorgeous. Thank you, Betty. You win. Put that in. Oh my god, I want to put them on the yeah. now. Oh, look at those subs. Shooting stars. They're huge. Good. Look at the subs. I'm going to get even huger by the 26th of December. <laughs> 